uh, this uh, 62 year old uh, lady presented with the uh, OPD with the complaint, chief complaint of uh, swelling in the anterior side of the neck from last 30 years. Initially had uh, only one into one centimeter uh, swelling in the anterior side of the neck, which is now gradually progressed to current size of five, uh, approximately five into five centimeter over last 30 years, with uh, no other uh, complaint for last 30 years. But now from last uh, uh, one month, patient is complaining of pain in the back, with uh, for which patient was operated in uh, neurosurgery uh, in view of. Uh, uh, tumor at the D7, D8. Ah, there was a metastasis. No, so yes, this is a case of metastatic thyroid cancer presenting with a metastasis at D8. D8 vertebra. Okay. okay. And uh, what was the histology when they operated? So the histology came out to be follicular thyroid carcinoma, sir. So metastatic. Follicular carcinoma was the diagnosis. Yes. How would you proceed now? If you look at it, there's so many. I mean, there are findings here. Forget the theoretical part of it, but you can see a lot of structures clearly because she's emaciated completely. You can see the head substrano pseudomastoid, and there is a, obviously a visible swelling. Thuk satakega mataji. बस 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 और कुछ हाँ बस बहुत बढ़िया धन्यवाद and you can see that there are dilated veins extending onto the anterior chest wall but not many there primarily it's here only yes sir so what would you do now sir we usually we do triple assessment sir for that actually you can see what is the structure here sir Ashman yes sir what is this uh, could be as a lymph, uh, lymph node. Uh, pulsating. Pulsar carotid. This is a carotid bifurcation. Bifurcation. And <laughs> there are all dilated veins that are visible, including the cross veins at the. This is where the ox point is. And this is where the spinal axis, the greater auricular nerve, can be seen. Yes, sir. That's a color, Mataji. You can see the greater auricular yes. nerve. So this is the ops point. So accessory should be in coming somewhere here. Give me a marker. Yes, sir. The auricular nerve. That should be the accessory and I can feel the accessory. Yeah. Two centimeters. This is the ops point. Yes. Where the greater auricular nerve is going. You can see it here. I will take a little bit more. Wait. Transfer cervical vessel. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. This is the floor of the posterior triangle. Splenius capitis, yes, levator scapulae, yeah. and sclenae, all the three sclenae here. And this is the... This is the sternocleomastoid tendon. You can see very clearly, dividing into two. In an emaciated individual, you can see. I can't see any node. And you can actually see the dilated external jugular and also the carotid pulsations are very clearly visible. Here. These are the carotid bifurcation. Okay. And here I can feel that it's a hard gland. Hard gland. The lymph nodes alongside and you find the veins are dilated on this side too. So basically a case of metastatic thyroid carcinoma. Yes, sir. I really like to examine from behind. But I don't want to make the patient uncomfortable. I have palpated from all the nodes. There are no nodes. After triple assessment, we should uh, prepare for the patient. Components of triple assessment. Sir, uh, for triple assessment, we for first go sir, uh, clinical examination and history. Then we go high resolution ultrasound. After that, we go for uh, guided biopsy. Sir. Uh, we see preferably thyroid function test. Thyroid function test. Not biopsy.